Hi guys, welcome back again to another video. Thank you so much for subscribing. Thank you for coming back again and again to watch this our video. So today's topic is regarding Jesus. How can you say he's the Son of God? But God says that if you deny me in, in front of people, he will deny you in heaven. That's what Jesus said. And so sometimes you may think that, oh, it doesn't matter if I denounce Christ, but God is watching. Yeah. He is seeing that, will my son and my daughter proudly proclaim us? Because at the end of the day, what matters is eternity. What matters is when we stand before God, when we hear, well done, good and faithful servant. And so I want to encourage you that even though you're in the West, even though you're in Canada, continue to raise the banner of Christ high. In school, in work, let people know that you're a Christian. Yeah. There shouldn't be a thing where they have to ask that you're a Christian. They should see through your fruits. Jesus says you will know them by their fruits. It's not necessarily that if you have to be on the pulpit and preaching or you are prophesying, he said you will know them by their fruits. So has Mary Westbourne said that if we want to know that we are Christian, it means that we really need to be patient to have a fruit of the spirit. We walk, make things possible, like we walk together. When we are listening to God, when we pay attention, we listen to God with the good and honorable instruction. In other words, we need to be careful of what and how we are listening to many people out there. That makes you a part. That makes you as a Christian. Gaining faith, repentance from your sin, is a way of you repenting, telling God, yes, I devote myself to you. And also, for you to be a part, you need to love one another. And that's what most of the people are lacking these days. Loving one another. And obeying word of God. That is make you among the people who call themselves, I am a child of God or I am a Christian. That's why you need to know. How do people know that you are Christian? Some people are afraid to share the word with other people because People don't want, she don't want to be known like she's a Christian, right? But while other people, they share their experience, they share the, the, the life, the faith they have at that moment. So as a Christian person, we should really have a sign of sharing the gospel among. There is no need for you to be afraid. You are a true Christian. You should have a sign of faith repentance from your sin, developing and having relationship with God is very, very important. It's not just, uh, I am a child of God. No. It's, are you devout to God? What does it mean to be devout to God? How patient you are? That is the thing you need to know. Love for one another. Do you still have it? Obedience. To God, what do you still have it? The real God, like reading word of God, has the child of God, do you still have it? You know, those are the things that you are a child of God that make you apart from the other people. You know, the blessing of obedience to word of God, that will bring you a real blessing. Fruit of the Spirit, which is making you also to be part of all those things. The fruit of the Spirit that make you as a Christianity, okay? Having faith, the most important thing of having faith in every situation you are in. Can everyone or someone be a Christian without displaying those signs? That is something people need to understand. Yeah? Have faith, obey the word of God, carry his word to many generations. Thank you so much and God bless you. See you again. Bye.